well based on electronics we must have deep comprehensive knowledge about transistors actually transistors are commonly used in smartphones computers robotics aeronautics and aerospace industries so it must be kept in mind that Transistors are very crucial in electronics. First of all, let's point out definition of transistor. Actually, transistors are three terminal semiconductor devices which are used to amplify or switch electrical signals and power. More clearly, transistors consist of three terminals namely emitter base and collector which are composed of semiconductor material like silicon or germanium as we talk about different categories of semiconductor of course we can find various types of transistors including bipolar junction transistor and field effect transistor in electronics let's go through bipolar junction transistor at first actually bipolar junction transistors are three terminal semiconductor devices with two pn junctions which are used to amplify or switch electrical signals and power based on arrangement of semiconductor material bipolar junction transistors are categorized into two types which are given below number 1 npn transistor number 2 pnp transistor at first let's point out PNP transistor the type of bipolar junction transistor in which an n type semiconductor layer is sandwiched between two identical p type semiconductor layers with holes being majority charge carriers is called PNP transistor more clearly PNP transistor is commonly used in amplifier current sourcing and complementary circuits most importantly based on salient features of PNP transistor we need to memorize its following features number 1 in case of PNP transistor an n type semiconductor layer is sandwiched between two identical p type semiconductor layers number 2 actually in case of pnp transistor holes are majority charge carrier however electrons are minority charge carrier number 3 in case of pnp transistor positive voltage is required at the base of transistor number 4 actually current flows from emitter to collector in case of pnp transistor number 5 as we talk about symbol of pnp transistor actually an arrow pointing into the emitter terminal is the actual symbol of pnp transistor similarly let's point out npn transistor the type of bipolar junction transistor in which a thin layer of p type semiconductor material is sandwiched between two n type semiconductor layers with free electrons being majority charge carriers is called npn transistor more clearly npn transistors are commonly used in amplifiers oscillators and logic gates 
most importantly based on salient features of npn transistor we need to memorize its following features number one in case of npn transistor p type semiconductor layer is sandwiched between two n type semiconductor layers number two in case of npn transistor free electrons are majority charge carriers however holes are minority charge carriers number three actually in case of npn transistor electric current flows from collector to emitter terminal number four in case of npn transistor Negative voltage is required at the base of transistor. Number five. As we talk about symbol of NPN transistor, of course, an arrow pointing outward the emitter terminal is the symbol of NPN transistor. Based on categories of transistors, let's point out field effect transistors. Actually, field effect transistors are three terminal semiconductor devices in which current flowing between two terminals source and drain is controlled by an electric field applied to the third terminal gate. More clearly, field effect transistors are commonly used in amplifiers, switches, voltage control resistors in analog circuits. Based on bipolar junction transistor, it is easier to understand about NPN transistor and PNP transistor as we talk about their salient features. So, let's go through comparison of salient features of NPN transistor and PNP transistor. Number one, in case of NPN transistor, P-type semiconductor layer is sandwiched between two N-type semiconductor layers. However, in case of PNP transistor, an N-type semiconductor layer is sandwiched between two identical P-type semiconductor layers. Number two, in case of NPN transistor, free electrons are majority charge carriers. Whereas, in case of PNP transistor, holes are majority charge carriers. Number three, in case of NPN transistor, negative voltage is required at the base of transistor. However, in case of PNP transistor, positive voltage is required at the base of transistor. Number four, in case of NPN transistor, electric current flows from collector to emitter terminal. Whereas, in case of PNP transistor, electric current flows from emitter to collector terminal. Number five, in case of NPN transistor, an arrow pointing outward the emitter terminal is the symbol of NPN transistor. Whereas, in case of PNP transistor, an arrow pointing into the emitter terminal is the symbol of PNP transistor. 